You know, it's uh, one day out from weigh-ins, so we are going to just flow here, you know, get the blood moving, get the calories going, turn the engine on. It's all about making weight right now, right? Like, don't get hurt and make weight, you know? Nah, nah he's not going to get any better or worse today. How's it going, Dad? Baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. You want to let daddy do his workout? She okay. does. Hi, daddy. Love you, daddy. Love you, buddy. Love you, Matt. <laughs> Today was great, man. It was kind of last hard day as far as intensity goes, but it's good to kind of finish strategy, preparation, kind of all tied some new sense tonight. There's no reason to keep studying for the test, you know what I mean? So it's like keeping my mind off the fight. I already know what to do. I didn't know what I'm going to do. So it's, you know, make weight. So the hard, the hard work's already done. Okay, switch. Everybody's body is beat up. If you're cutting weight right now, you're not dehydrated, you're not sore, you might need to go down a different weight. Any of those painful? Mm -mm. Good. And out, and out, and out. Kind of sore right there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, he knows my body, and obviously this That's is my last bad. workout before I make weight. I feel good, good, but I want to feel really so good. Inside. I don't have that much weight to lose, so I want to get it off fast. I don't want to be down there pounding my body, doing all this extra stuff. So just getting the game plan and being loose and upset calls out. Um, this is what it's all about. If you're a welterweight, lightweight, bantamweight, freaking tickle weight, whatever weight you are, you should be desiring to be at the top of the throne. It's too, too much hard work, too many people that are doing it, too much sacrifice from family, beating up your body, mentally focusing for so many weeks on one particular person that you should have this, this goal in mind. So it's what you fight for. She says no punching, but once she gets her attitude, she's gonna start Damn punching. Damn rules go out the window. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. <laughs> I love you to do the face. Some people just got their face, they just wanna punch, you know? <laughs> My mom said no one would ever wanna punch me. Yeah, all right. You have to be okay with challenges, you know? You can't, it shouldn't be easy. You shouldn't want it to be easy because the, what would it all be for? You have to have the pain, the satisfaction of victory, you know? You learn to like pain in a kind of weird way, you know? Nobody grows from being comfortable. Once you get in, in a habit of doing that, it's, it's not, it's more of a lifestyle rather than just uh, making yourself do it. thinking about a uh, fight, uh, I think about uh, making a leg. I take a hot bath with salt and with uh, some oil. This is part of my job. Like my daddy. <laughs> Or mommy. <laughs> Come to puppy. <laughs> One fourteen and a half. Oh. We're all good. Bunch of good in Sweden. Yeah. <laughs> One sixteen. Got it. And then five seconds of pulling after you get on, after you reach your weight. 170. One seventy one. Flip it off. Don't lift me. Thank you, Matt. You just roll on the stage. Thank you, Matt. One seventy. Right. 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 
Like a second way, just anybody who's with him. Like shirt, shorts, pants. 170. Thank you, sir. Cool. Not only in stand up, but she has a very good uh, wrestling. She scrambled well, kind of like Paige, how she uses some momentum. This is MMA, everything can happen. But Carolina, you could tell she likes to strike, Yeah. but she's not opposed to anything else. You're going to draw her into it, and then she's going to start getting too aggressive and start reaching. Like people talk about her being all calm and stuff like that, but it's always different, though. You got to be ready for anything, like, because it's not always the same circumstance. You're not always finding the same person, so I might bring out something different in her. Perfect. Yay. Usually when you go to the weigh-ins, it's when it's real, you feel like this is real now. Let me just get on the scale, give it up to the Atlanta fans, do our face off and I'm out. We fight tomorrow, ain't no point in me trying to do all that stuff right now. I'm gonna do it tomorrow anyway. What's happening in Atlanta? We got a great card for you and we kick things off in the welterweight division. Robbie! 